All right, everybody. I uh, gonna do just kind of a quick video. Uh, I went and bought this camera right here that you see. That's the SJ Cam uh, M30. I think. Anyway, it's the dash cam. It's not one of the action cams, so this one doesn't have a battery. Uh, runs off of a USB cord that you hook up to, like your uh, uh, cigarette lighter or something like that. And I forget the other name, power, whatever they call it, because they don't make cigarette lighters, it seems, anymore. Do this one handed. So I bought this because the oops, I don't know what that thing is. The little cube one that I have, Polaroid cube, only lasts for two hours uh, on a charge and only supports 32, I think 32 gigabyte or smaller uh, SD cards. This one goes up to like 60, 64. I don't have very much. I think every time I set it down, it like slides back in a little bit. There we go. Uh, there's tons of reviews and things on, and you know, unboxings or whatever these uh, stickers. Which stickers can be cool. Uh, there's just a camera. This little lens, I guess, protective lens. Little instructions. That little peel away deal for the screen. There's just, it's like a three inch, two and a half inch screen, something like that. Actually, doesn't feel too bad. Pull it out, set it back up in there. Little cleaning cloth, some more stickers. Instruction manual. So uh, back to why I bought this. Uh, that one wasn't cutting it. The other one that I had bought, uh, that was a dash cam. It worked all right. Uh, had a small screen on it and stuff. Sound was all right. Just I was losing footage. For whatever reason, I don't know. Like I have issues with with it shutting off or something. Maybe it was getting too hot. Hopefully, this one won't have the same problems. So I plan on getting a few more cards, SD cards, to stick in that thing uh, when I'm out. And that's why I bought it for when I was out riding trails or whatever, just out driving. Okay, well anyway, that's the mount. Can't open it with one hand. <sighs> I got a mess here on this desk. And the USB cord. And then the little, what's it called, the little charger which ain't bad because I got a ton of these I had bought a bunch of them uh, Walmart had had a few of them on sale that I had bought because they're clearance so each vehicle has one of these this they're always good to have you, know, you never know if they're gonna wear out or burn out That was actually actually like just like that, but yeah, I bought that for the trails and just driving. Uh, so we'll see how it works out. Actually, wasn't too bad. I think I spent like sixty-eight bucks or something on it, which uh, I've seen uh, 
video, other videos where they're talking where you can get them for like less, but I got this off of Amazon. So, let's look at the mount. I mean, that's the cord. I want to open it with my teeth. Okay. Oops. And the mob came off the side. There's, there it is. That's where I was thinking. Let's see, I was trying to look at this thing. I think I might be able to take one of those other little camera mounts that I have and cut out one of the center uh, little tabs in it and this thing will slide right up in it because I have the for the other cameras it's all up in the behind the uh, what you call it the rear view mirror uh, I wanted to come over here and, and just kind of show this thing that I had just bought off of eBay it's a low dose let's go around Uh, LTP 5000D, so it has the pilot light, no uh, strike, plasma cutter. Uh, and I ordered this just the other day and it came today, so I'm pretty excited, pretty happy about that. Actually, I think, uh, yeah, I won the bid yesterday. So I got it for a lot cheaper. It's brand new, so hopefully it works pretty good. There was some damage on the box, but hoping that there's nothing wrong with the product inside so we'll be breaking that out here one of these times try it out I'm gonna try building a winch bumper for one of the other Jeeps maybe for a buddy of mine's Toyota uh, so we'll see gotta get another air compressor I think uh, better get one now cuz uh, where I'm at they're having them on sale at uh, Home Depot for uh, I can get them for 161 uh, I don't know if I did a did anything with the one that I had uh, like showed you guys it the one that I bought but I want to get at least another one and eventually I might get a third one rather than get uh, like a really big standalone like permanent and yeah, my toes walking around barefooted I don't feel well today uh, I ended up calling in but anyway uh, going back to bed but I got that now so we'll be making stuff hopefully here pretty soon uh, but yeah, I want to get two air compressors. Hopefully they'll, it'll handle this thing. I don't plan on going into like super big production making stuff, but I wanted to make some stuff and uh, like on the side that I can just kind of won't be too big that I can hang on to while I put it on Craigslist or eBay or wherever and try to sell some just to, some products, you know, they're cheap, maybe a few bumpers maybe some uh outdoor uh stoves you know i don't know we'll see little things <sighs> but yeah that's what i got i'm waiting on a couple other things but they're not big deal i'm waiting on a hat and which is funny why would i buy a hat well it was a cool looking hat camo uh, with the flag and stuff on it. And actually those, you know, one of the things I do is I wear the Superman emblem on my hats. And I wanted one with the Superman emblem that was like more camoed. And that's what this one is, camoed. 
uh, and the American flag, like in the emblem, it's pretty neat. But uh, waiting for some other parks. But yeah, I'm rambling now. So uh, I bought a couple sets of these. I don't know if I showed you. Showed those. Uh, may I'll go out in a different video and show. Uh, I haven't installed them yet. There's those ones and the others are sitting off somewhere else. My lunch box. But I bought, went to Harbor Freight and bought their new and improved Badland uh, ZXR is what they're calling it. 12,000 pound winch. It works, but I haven't gotten to like really test it out. I have the other one sitting there on that end of the box. That's the old one. And I can see all the dust floating around. Uh, it still worked. As far as I could tell, I mean, before the accident. So I need a new control box. You know, the little red... And then I need to weld a weld something to the end of the spool lever there, and get back working. And then I'm gonna make a put that one on a uh, receiver mount, and then I'm gonna build probably one of the bumpers. I'm gonna build. Uh, actually, I'll put that on the gold Jeep. I think so. I'll build a winch bumper for it. But I was thinking about putting it on a receiver. Uh, mount because I think on my white Jeep that's what I want to that's the way I want to go with it is just have a winch on a receiver uh, so I can move it front to back or vehicle to vehicle you know so we'll see but it, it supposedly still worked uh, there's I don't know how many reviews of these winches not since they updated but of the Badlands brand. Uh, a lot of places uh, that I've read online on forums say they're really good. Uh, they haven't had problems with them. Uh, except for the Switch, I guess. Um, so maybe I'll do a review. It's like 45 seconds on and like 15 minutes off. or I can't remember. I got the instructions floating around. Uh, I need to keep those. But I put this on the end of the pickup on the Comanche. So, and it works. And like I said, it'll turn on and uh, pull back in. But I haven't gotten to really test it out. I was going to do it this weekend on Sunday. Some friends and I are going out just to hang out, go shooting, drive around in some mud, just hang out. And then, uh, I might do it on Saturday, but I don't know if I wanted to go to a concealed carry class or not. Uh, they were offering Oregon. They're all 53, no, 50, it's not 53 states. Could you, there's only 30, uh, 45 states or something like that. I can't remember. It was most of the states except for California and whatever. But anyway, just wanted to show this stuff that I got uh, here recently. And we'll have to do some reviews on it. I've been pretty busy. I'm working nights still. Uh, I'm not getting promoted, but I'm getting moved up uh, to where I'll have more responsibilities. So that's going to take a lot of a toll on me I think a little bit till I get used to it I haven't done very many videos uh, next one will probably be uh, pushing the Volvo the Volvo out of my garage getting that plasma cutter and the air compressor set up I got to wire in some breakers for those um, and uh, losing my and then just cleaning up the garage again, getting it all ready, trying to save up my money still, like even from that loan, 
uh, so I can do the back patio, the fence, and then the uh, an awning. So, uh, and then maybe part of the driveway. I want to widen the driveway, but we'll see. But anyway, everybody, uh, you all take care now. Uh, we'll get back to you with some other videos hopefully here pretty soon.